Teacher talk on sports, what it does, what it do, how we live. And we've seen fans of professional sports teams stage protests. Maybe they believe that the owner isn't interested in winning. Maybe they believe the owner isn't willing to spend um, you know, what he's capable of spending. Or maybe they believe the manager should go. Uh, you know, sometimes they're successful, sometimes they're a blip in the radar, and one that occurred yesterday surely seems like the latter being a blip in the radar. Now, I am actually a Miami Marlins fan, so I've heard throughout the years how uh, jokes about their attendance, how their games are not, there's a lot of empty seats the majority of the time. Really, there's only been Two guys who have been able to get Miami Marlins fans uh, to the stadium. That was Dontrell Willis in the uh, early to mid-2000s. And then Jose Fernandez in the mid-2010s. Rest in peace, legend. Uh, but Marlins fans staged a protest on Friday. And this via CBS Sports. Marlins fans call on owner Bruce Sherman to sell the team after Luis Arise trade other departures. A small group gathered outside Lone Depot Park prior to Friday's game. That word small may be an understatement as very, very few people showed up. So mentions before Friday's game, another loss to the Phillies. Fans had signs imploring owner Bruce Sherman to sell the team, among other things. Here is the small crowd of protests. Um, so a couple of signs are written in Spanish. See the one Sherman sell the team. And then here, Stanton, Yelich, Ozuna, Real Muto, Pablo Lopez, Arise, um, Eotros, and others. Um, you know, I'm guessing he's not happy that... Uh, all these players have been traded off. Kind of odd to write Lopez and Arise since Pablo Lopez was actually traded for Luis Arise. Um, Christian Yelich looking fabulous for the Brewers this season, although he was hurt. And Marcelo Zuna, man, he has been incredible after some down seasons. Um, the small demonstration of, listen to this, no more than 10 people was organized to convey fan discontent with the direction of the franchise. There were signs and posters, including one demanding that own, owner Bruce Sherman sell the team. There were only a few here, but the majority of fans are disgusted, said Luis de Armas, a decades-long Marlins fan and the organizer of Friday's protests. We want to continue coming to the games, but not when it remains a losing club. All because of an owner who promised us one thing and did something else. So, my question is, if it's no more than 10 people, how come you can't count the exact amount that were part of the um, protest? Um, you know, you could count on your fingers how many people were there if it's no more than 10. Why couldn't we get an exact number? Uh, but yes, the Marlins have been a terrible franchise this season, um, you know. Just to put it bluntly, they are 10-30. and 30. That is the worst record in baseball. It's crazy to think. Through 40 games, they are 17 and a half games out of first place. Just through 40 games. They're minus 85 run differential. Tied for the worst in baseball. They're currently playing right now. And... Last I checked, it was 4-1 Phillies in the seventh inning. So unless a comeback occurs, they will be 10-31. and 31. Um, Yes, they've dealt with a lot of injuries. Sandy Alcantara, Yuri Perez out for the season. Um, but it's still, they really didn't do much this offseason too, uh, especially to improve the hitting, which really wasn't good last year. <clears throat> Excuse me, despite making the playoffs where they um, lost in two games to the Phillies in a best of three series in the opening round. But what are your thoughts? I mean, couldn't I, I get that Marlins don't get a lot of fans, but I know that a lot of Marlins fans are frustrated with uh, the direction of the team. They really couldn't get more than 10 people to come to this protest or maybe you know they should have made sure that 
they schedule it on a day where more people would join them where it could actually make a slight difference having a protest because a protest of no more than 10 people i don't expect it to affect much at all anyhow don't forget to subscribe tell a friend to tell a friend to tell a friend to subscribe like the video share the video hit the bell for notifications i'm out